today we are meeting up with two other youtubers so we've never met them in person but we have talked to them online so we are really excited to meet up with them I don't typically like KOAs, but this is nice. They even have a shuttle that takes you to the beach. So we made it here when you come off of General Booth Boulevard. So we are literally right here in Site 348. It's a back-end spot. Picnic table here, little fire pit over there. The cool thing about being in this spot actually is that the main area is right there so the pool bounce pad all the activities there's actually a water slide today all of that stuff is right over there so that's pretty cool that's what's up right there all right I was a little excited because I saw how nice it looked from the entrance but once I got to the site I felt like, yeah, this is a KOA. So let me show you what we're working with here. Typical KOA. Right next to your neighbors. When you come to KOA, you gotta be prepared to cozy up with the neighbors. Got about a good 10 to 15 feet separation there. And we got full hookups, so that's a plus. We don't always have that luxury. Got your sewer hose, got your water, got your cable, and you got your power, 50 and 30 amp. Barely made it to the sewage connection. I had to put a little stretch on that sewage pipe. As you can see, it goes all the way to the back. Hopefully it'll stay in place once the uh, fecal matter starts flowing. <laughs> Sorry for the images. Let me show you what it looks like from the back side. All right, there you go. Little bit more space here. Cozied up to that neighbor there. Not too bad. I don't mind that distance. Over here. Not so much. And this is where we hang out, so would have been better if this side was a little bit more spacious, but whatever, you know, it is what it is. Yeah, I was speaking to the gentleman that works here and he tells me the beach is actually three miles from here. Probably should have bought another bike for Elena. I only brought two bikes because I thought we had beach access from the park. All right, guys, about to get some firewood because I smell people burning firewood right now and it smells so good. Let's go see where the firewood is out here at this uh, holiday cave away. Let's check out their little general store, see if they have any firewood here. We got some snacks with the firewood. So basically what you do is you just come to the general store, you pay inside per bundle and these $8 per bundle. They have a really cool little pool area here and this amazing field I want to take a peek at real quick before I head back. Check this out. Listen, I, I'm actually impressed with this KOA with the general grounds. It's really nice. It's well manicured. Tennis court. Open field for whatever. They got a bouncy area there. Basketball court. Oh, you know I'm shooting some hoops. We'll get a closer look later. Not too shabby. So what I do? Open it. Oh, like the propane tank when I do the black thing. And click it. Whoa. Okay. How easy was that? Um, no, shut off the gas. Okay. All the way to the right. That's, yeah, that's intense. It. <laughs> that was really intense. She was really scared to do that. Cause it was intense like that was a lot of action see burning nicely i did that easy peasy i did that get you one on amazon <laughs> nah you just oh. get this from like home depot <laughs> okay 
Good morning, guys. We're about to head out to a little fitness group meetup. So I want, before we leave, I wanted to remind everybody, make sure you shut the water off from going into your camper, just in case you have a leak or something on the inside, especially if you have a pet and you, know, you don't want to flood the RV. Not that it'll flood, but you know, don't want to take any risk, right? And also make sure that you block your RV because ultimately someone can manually steal your RV, really, uh, with a couple little tools. So get one of those hitch locks. Uh-oh, somebody's ready to get it in. Yes. Good morning. I am so excited this morning to be going to the E2M meetup here at Virginia Beach. It was like meant to be. We were already planning to camp here with some friends and then it just so happened that they dropped a meetup location for Virginia Beach for the same exact weekend. So I was like, whoa! <laughs> okay, I could not sleep last night. That's how excited I was. Yeah, I'm dead serious. Like, I woke up and I could not stop thinking about this meetup, which is so ridiculous. Harry keeps calling it a cult. Don't do that. It's kind of cult like. It's like a healthy cult. Yeah, it's a good cult. I mean, if you look up the definition of cult, technically, it could be like a cult. Like a second or like. I don't know. Secondary definition. Like, you know how you look at the definitions and they give you the primary definition and then you keep scrolling down and they give you the other definitions? Technically, it could be a cult. I was looking at it. I was like, hmm. But we just assume that cult means something bad, right? But anyway, I'm rambling. Yeah, ramble to death. <laughs> anyway, we're headed to the soccer field complex right now to meet up with other E2M members in the area and to do a 45 minute hit workout and a meet and greet with the instructors. And then I think they're gonna have merch and people are gonna meet up for lunch and stuff after that. I don't think we're gonna do any of that. We're just gonna do the workout, the meet and greet, and then we're gonna head back to the campground to hang out with our friends. So that is the plan. <laughs> Like 50 I know. I was like, I'm gonna be in town. We going. Keisha was like, it's too early. I was like, come on, girl. Let's go. Hello. Hey. Henry. This is Trina. Hi. Hi. This is my daughter, Lena. Hi. Hi. Good boy. Okay. Trey, what's going on, Trey? Are you ready to work out? All right. Eat you in. Yeah. <laughs> We are thankful for you guys. We couldn't do it without you. We love you guys. Continue to spread the good news about H2M so we can keep this thing going. I'm gonna get you guys up out of the sun. We'll be over in the shade, okay? So come over, shade, line up, and clap it up for yourself. Be like, whoa, 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 clap, clap it up real quick. So we just finished our little 45 minute hit workout. Big brother Jeff. What's up, bro? E2M coaches. We should get a little closer picture with them a little later.
video. I'm gonna just screenshot. Y'all can do different poses. Whatever y'all want. It's a wide angle, so I got y'all. Hey guys, we got to meet our fitness coaches in real life, which is weird. You know, we've been following these folks for months on the internet. So it was pretty cool to meet in real life with no mask on and nothing like that, you know. E2M guys, check it out. If you guys are uh, looking to be a little healthier in life, enjoy camping as long as possible. E2M might be a good option for you. It's worked for us. I've lost about 24 pounds. My wife has lost about 15 or so. My daughter is also doing it with us. It's worked out really great for us. So uh, check out E2M. But this is not just a workout. It's a lifestyle, psychological, physical, dietary, general health. We put a link down below. That way you don't have to go searching for it. Just click, uh, <laughs> click somewhere down there, somewhere. So now that we have finished up our workout, we went back to the campground to grab our beach gear. And we're heading over to the beach. The beach is about roughly two and a half to three miles from the campground. So they have a really nice bike trail that you can actually ride to the beach from the campground. But if you don't want to do that, there's a trolley. You do have to pay for the trolley. That'll take you from the campground to the beach or you can just drive. And we're parking here. $5 for the first hour and then $3 for every additional hour. Yeah, so it's not too bad. No, it's affordable. We out here hanging out with searching but while super seeing. beach by me so now we're gonna go explore all the way down to boardwalk well <laughs> attempt we'll attempt yeah they have a dedicated bike path which is pretty cool Maya hold on hold on it's a cool little area. Good morning guys. So uh, we are on our way to do a little laundry because we're trying a new technique of leaving stuff in the RV and washing it while we're out camping. Maybe shoot a little hoops. It's been a couple years since I've uh, put a whooping on this one here. Yeah, it has been. We're just trying to use that new technique you saw on that YouTube I want to try it. I watched this video this morning and it basically teaches you this technique where you cannot miss. And I mean, I know it's probably not realistic, but I'm gonna try that, that out. That was clickbait, they got you. Yeah, I mean, he was hitting it, but like it could have been edited. It could have been. I can tell if something's edited, so I don't think so. That's why I believe it'll work. So laundromat, 250 per machine, and dryer is also 250 for about 30 minutes, I believe. I'm gonna show you how it's done, bro. I'm a pro now after watching that video. <laughs> about to see Curry 2.0 here. Wow. Technique, I think it kind of works. He probably practices a lot. 
that's why he's good at it but i mean me just cold started shooting i started making a few so watch stand right there okay It takes me about 10 before I make one. But let's see how long it takes. Yeah, buddy. We shoot. Okay. That's one. That hardly ever happens. Okay. I rarely hit it on like the second or third shot. Okay. It's usually number 10 or 11. So basically, you got to be able to kind of palm the ball a little bit. My hands aren't that big, so I, I still struggle with it, but. So you hold it like you're palming it. Okay, I'll try that again. Oh, I, I told you that. I need to move, I need to get closer. Okay. Try the uh, little trick. You need to get closer though. Okay, well, I can't grip the ball. No, I just try to, like, try to grip it and shoot it. Okay. You're too far. Oh, you can see my dream was never to go to the NBA. Spud Web was pretty cool too. Spud Web? <laughs> what do you know about these guys? <laughs> I know Spud Web was uh, 5 foot 7, I think. Yeah. Um, and he did the dunk contest too. You know me and you both? You knew both? Yeah. <laughs> you are not 13. <laughs> I am. We're 40. <laughs> Come on, make a shot. Ooh, got that on video. Do another one. Uh oh. Hey, okay, cut that one out. This is only showing. No, 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 no. I'm sure you're not cutting mine out. Can you borrow some of his skills? So I'm pretty much accomplishing my goal, which is to get the ball into the ditch, not the hole. Like that's so overrated, getting it over there. Right, I right, prefer the right. ditch. Wow, yeah, <laughs> great. You know how much you got there? Great, Four, 475. Do you have enough to get your magnet? Well, my magnet, right? We got a couple dollars extra in my pocket. Now this is a really good one right here. How's that? Yeah, that's better. So here we are, day number three here at the KOA. It was supposed to be rainy. Look at the weather. Yep, that's what happens when you listen to the weatherman. Or that's what happens. Yeah, that's what, whatever. I don't know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> anyway, Henry never- your coffee this morning? Not enough caffeine, apparently. Anyway, Henry has this thing where he's like, you know what, I don't care if the weather's supposed to be bad, we're still going. And I'm like, oh no, I'm scared to be in the RV if it's gonna storm, you know? And it seems like nine times out of 10, when it's supposed to rain, it never does. So as you can see, all, with all our advancement in technology, sometimes the radars are still not that reliable. So we've been taking our chances and we've been pleasantly surprised. So when all else fails, including actual repairs from the dealership, use duct tape. Right, babe? The proof is in the pudding, no leaks. No leakage. What, do I have to sit next to you? <laughs> oh, you sound like Henry. <laughs> okay, it's so hard working with you. I can't do this anymore. Yeah, it's the star of the show. Why do you always think you're the star of the show? The mood has to be right. This is what we love about them. All right, as you can hear in the background, we are not alone camping this weekend. We are actually here with two other YouTube channels that create great content. Right now, we're going to introduce you to Amped to Glamp. Hey, everyone. We're Amped to Glamp. I'm Sherry. I'm John. Sherry, John. They're hanging out with us here at Virginia Beach KOA. Tell people what your channel is about, what kind of content you produce. Yeah, sure. So we actually just purchased our first RV back in November of 2020. Right. And then it was finally delivered in April. Right. And we said, you know what? We're going to make a lot of mistakes. <laughs> and I didn't say that. <laughs> 
I said he is going to make a lot of mistakes. How's that, better? No. <laughs> and, Much worse. And I said, let's get this all on camera for the world to see. Yeah, that was all her. <laughs> but actually, no, really. We wanted to document our journey from when we first got our RV so that other people could actually learn from our mistakes, right, by seeing what we did. And also, we just thought it'd be a lot of fun. You know, it's like, you know, there's this thing called YouTube that I just found out about like a year and a half ago. And I never watched a YouTube video. I hadn't. I didn't know what YouTube oh, was. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. And I said, like, you know what? Let's, let's, this looks like fun. Let's, let's document our travels. Let's, let's see if we can build a community that can help each other out as newbies. We can all, like, you know, there were a lot learn of... Learn together. Learn together, exactly. Right. And we actually had a lot of experienced RVers who hopped on our channel and subscribed and gave really good advice and feedback to everyone. And to us, too. We had a lot of people telling us what to do. Oh, no, you're doing that wrong. You need to change it, right? Right. So what do you think? Oh, sorry, go ahead. Oh, no, it's fine. I never do anything wrong. <laughs> <laughs> what was your biggest mistake that you've made so far while RVing? You have one? Our biggest okay. mistake was buying a Fleetwood Bounder. <laughs> no, don't put that in there. <laughs> Everybody on our channel knows that we, we just we had issues, we're, but we're up front, right? We're not going to sugarcoat anything. And I really have regrets about buying a Fleetwood Bounder. I have regrets about buying a class, a gas RV. Yes. I think okay. we should have bought a, a diesel. A diesel would have been better. Yeah, okay. we really didn't spend enough time, I think. You know, it was COVID. We wanted to find a new way to travel. We couldn't do our normal method of traveling, right. which was through cruises. And we were like, Let, let's just get what we can get. And we could get a Fleetwood. Yeah. within a certain amount of time. We were supposed to have it by January. It didn't come to April, but... Well, the thing was, we liked the way things looked, and we saw Holiday Rambler, which is a twin of Fleetwood. Okay. And the interiors are beautiful. The vehicle was beautiful. I mean, we ordered one. Are you done interrupting me? No. <laughs> Did you not hear me talking? No. I was talking. Anyway. <laughs> this is... This is not right. I love you, I love you John. He's abuse. <laughs> I know. He's abuse. I abuse him all the time. You know, we have one video. It's really funny because what did she say? She said, be, please be nice to the gentleman. <laughs> please be nice to the, one of the nice commenters. gentleman. The nice gentleman? I just, she just said, please be nice to the gentleman. Yeah. I'm kind of. Oh, we got another hey. member. Okay, oh, this is our son. Our guest star. Justin, our guest star. Oh, the star. Which one is it? <laughs> he's always with us when he's off from uh, college. Yep. <laughs> yep. Travels with us. Very nice. So, guys, we will put their channel right here and in the description box. Somewhere up there. Yeah, Henry always goes somewhere up there. He never knows which way to point. Make sure to check them out. They have a great channel. Well, that was Amp to Glimp. Now, let me go walk over here and see if uh, Searching While Super Seeing is available for a... Uh, quick chat this is their rig this is crazy i will do a legit tour another day once we meet up again this won't be our last meetup when this is when i wanted to introduce you guys to the audience hey so everybody you plug your channel in there come here d come here diggy i know d don't want to come out so yeah no d, d don't want to come out there's a third one to the trio here but she's camera shy we'll get her next time definitely, definitely. but anyway uh, just introduce your channel man talk about what, you, what, you, what your channel is about uh, let, let the audience know. Our channel is Searching While Super C. It's mostly about RVing and a little bit of some Lego builds and some other surprises. We've become friends this weekend and this won't be our last camping trip together. No. We're going we're gonna to plan a, f a few more uh, trips. Definitely. 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 So when's your next video coming out? Mm. Do you do weekly? Ooh. Do you do no. bi-weekly? So during it's school year, random. unfortunately, we only do about uh, once every couple months, feels like. Okay. Okay. Um, but now that school is almost out, we'll be back to at least doing once a month, okay. sometimes twice a month. So yeah, throw so some shorts in there. I mean, you can't do like a, a long form video. Just do a you know one minute short. Definitely. Just Might to keep with the uh, with the uh, light bar installed. Yeah, I love yeah. your um your talking head though too. Oh you, yeah. You guys together doing the talking heads? I love that. A lot of people ask us a lot of questions, and, and and we get to the point where we're like, you know what? Let's go ahead and wrap all those questions up into one. Right. Right. And you know, do like a little session where we go back and forth and have question and answers right awesome searching while super seeing i will put a link to their channel in the description below check them out